Hey, this is Alex Power, and in today's tutorial, I will show you how to create a fake rack focus in Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2017. Let's get started. Okay, I have two clips on my timeline. On the first clip, model entering the room, and she's kind of far away, so I would like to have her a little closer in order to apply a rack focus. So somewhere around here would be perfect but let's first combine these two clips and we can do this by just putting them together and just let's let's watch it well it doesn't look that great so in order to make it nicer we can go to effects and we can go to dissolve here and uh, grab the cross dissolve put it right in the middle it's not always coming in the middle here sometimes it goes to the right or to the left side in order to change that to put it right in the middle you need to press on this one and make sure it's center at cut the first bullet right here that's what it's supposed to be and uh, let's look at right now so she's entering far away and then she's suddenly closer it's already a pretty nice effect which is built in to your premiere pro and you don't need to tweak anything it just goes like that but purpose of this tutorial is to emulate a rack focus effect that can be often done in the camera. In the effects, we will look for a fast blur. We'll just drop this onto the clip. No adjustment layers, just straight to the clip. I will press this stopwatch here to create a keyframe. And we'll put the values at around 100, a little more, that's fine. As you've noticed right away, this edge is here lost some details in order to restore them you just need to check this box repeat edge pixels and it will rebuild all the pixels at the edges so that's pretty good now what we need to do we're at the very remember very first frame right here very first frame now it's all blurry so we need to go probably right around here i don't know what is your footage going to look like but I'm gonna apply a second keyframe here by pressing this diamond. We'll create a second keyframe and I'll put values back to zero. And uh, we can go back to, to video transitions, dissolve and grab this cross dissolve and put it right in the middle here. Okay, right now we can take a look what we got so far. And that's how you create a fake rack focus effect in Adobe Premiere Pro CC 2017. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, drop a comment, and press this bell notification button that you won't miss any of the future videos that I release on this channel. See you next time.